Milford, Connecticut is a small, bustling New England waterfront community with some pretty great food. But if you're talking about breakfast, you gotta come to downtown right across from the courthouse and go to the corner brunch with dishes like South Indian spiced duck breakfast, African hash, Malaysian pulled pork. Oh, they had me at pulled pork. You know the restaurant road trip crew had to come down here and check this out. Even the gluten-free stuff sounds great. I can't wait to try it. Michelle, it's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet Seriously. you too. It's, I mean, I came in here and just felt like I was like with family. Thank you. That's, that's, cool. that's something you create, the vibe you created. Yeah, I really try hard to make it a comfortable place for everyone to come. The, the chef <laughs> industry alone around out here talks about you guys. Really? Yes, oh, I can't wait to try the food because I want to see what we're all talking about. <laughs> Thank um, you. We've been here a long, it's 25 years, so thank 25 you. years, there's no, <laughs> that's not easy to do in this business. Back then, when it came to brunch, no, there was nothing out there except muffin scones. Now everyone's doing yeah, brunch. Everybody's we doing were like brunch. the original, you know? <laughs> well, it's funny because it's one of the best brunches in the country, right? Thank you, yes, we are rated as top 20. We try to bring dinner concepts into breakfast. Well, speaking of non-traditional, what do we have here in front of us? This looks great. This is a cardamom chai. I kind of wish my wife would call me cardamom chai. It just sounds like a nice name, doesn't it? Oh, we gotta go for it. Yeah. Wow. Napkin, we need That's a what it, well, What's wrong? What's, what happened? This is a staple, the s'mores hot cocoa. A lot of kids come for this one. Are you kidding me? Destination. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> you guys are crushing it. This is so fun. I feel like you and your husband is in the kitchen for the most part here, right? Yeah. Do you guys kind of compete? You're like, oh, he's got this. Uh, I got this great dish. She's like, did you see my hot cocoa? <laughs> the best part is when we collaborate. We, we just understand each other and we work well together. And when we help each other out and pick up the slack where we need to for each other or, you know. I love it. I love that I can see the passion that you have. Michelle, thanks for having us. Kitchen's this way? This way, yeah. All right. You enjoy that hot chocolate or bring it with you. I'm going to the kitchen. See how much trouble I can get in. Oh boy. All right, Chef, nice to meet you. Hey, nice to meet nice you, Chef. Nice All right, what are we making here? Because there's a lot of stuff going on back here. Uh, we're going to start with our South Indian spiced duck. Sounds delicious. I'm it's in. Uh, one of our favorite uh, dish that we serve over here. It's, uh, it's a cooked duck with a lot of spices that I have over here. Okay, let's go. All right, where do we start? What do you want me to do? You got onions? Yeah, onions. In the pan? Yeah, in the pan. And we're gonna caramelize them. Let those guys kind of cook down yeah, a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, Let's talk about these spices because you got them all nicely mise en place out right yes, here. Yes, yes. Salt, pepper, paprika. This is cayenne pepper. And this is garam masala. Okay, okay. So we mix all this together. Am I gonna regret this? Oh, no, no, no. Not at all. Not at all. Ooh. Ooh, that's nice. You wanna go a little further? Yeah, a little bit more. But what's happening is you wanna get this off the bottom of the pan. When you see that browning that occurs on the bottom of the pan, that's called fond, F-O-N-D. A lot of flavors where that is. It gets locked in there. You, you ready for yeah, it, yeah, tomatoes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so these guys are gonna cook down. Let's cook down just a little bit, yeah, like five minutes, 10 minutes. Beautiful. All right, you can add the spices. A little more. Okay. Okay, a little bit more. Wow, okay. All right, that's good. All right, that's good, that's good. That's good. <laughs> Technical culinary terms, a little bit more. So mix this in? Yeah, mix this right in. So this is the base for the entire dish this right here, right? This is the base for the wow. entire dish, yeah. Okay. So the smell from these spices is pretty unbelievable right now. Oh yeah. This is great. Check out this duck right here. It's all about the flavors and they are the marriage of all the flavors. So hey guys, look how cool this looks. Did you kind of want some of that, Dan? Yeah, me too. So we're gonna make the two scrambled eggs. So I'm gonna bring this right here. You can put that right on top of that. We're gonna wrap this tortilla. And then we're gonna wrap this tortilla in bacon. We're gonna wrap the whole thing in bacon? Yes. So here, you're gonna put that over there. There we go. <laughs> now we're talking. We're gonna fry the whole thing up like that? That's crazy talk. I love it. The combination of the food are like looking up on the sky and the stars are the spices. You can put anything, anything together. Wow. <laughs> we definitely could. Right. Give a little drip on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give it a little cut. Just go like a little bit, yeah, yeah, go, that's perfect. And then we just plate it. Oh my God, that looks incredible. And we got home fries over here, right? Well done, crispy home fries always. This looks incredible, are you kidding me? All right, Bobby. I'm gonna go find some stars and spices in the yeah. sky and figure it all out. <laughs> Chef, this food 
I've never seen any th breakfast food that looks like this in my life. I'm so excited. Well, I'm glad you guys are here. Uh, this is like the evolution of breakfast for 25 years. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Have you, you been know? doing breakfast for 25 years? Yeah, we are here for 25 wow. years. Yeah, yep, congratulations yep. on that. That's incredible. Thank you. Good thank for you, you, man. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's jump in here. All right. Peaches and cream stuffed French toast. All right, here we go. Let's get some of this on here. We stuffed the bread with the uh, oh sliced peaches, a little bit of cream cheese. Wow. This dish is, oh my gosh. This is this is one of the ones that came from the stars, didn't it? For right, 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 you right. You know, constantly like, trying and trying and trying. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what is the cream here? Is it, is it yogurt, cream cheese maybe? What else we got? What we use is the cream cheese. Mm -hmm. And we use uh, condensed milk and evaporated milk. Mm. And then we blend it all in together. I mean, this this is the best French toast I've ever had. You guys, you, you gotta try this. This is, I had no idea this even existed. Now that I do, I feel like everything's complete in my life. This is crazy, I can't stop eating it. Beautiful, beautiful dish here. Malaysian pulled pork. Pork is actually slow roasted and it's marinated in the Malaysian spices. I'm a little worried about the ginger killing me, but I got a feeling that you got right. you know what you're doing you here. Know, I'll be honest with you, the ginger goes perfectly with this. Wow. And the flavors are like, oh. unbelievable. This pork is a crazy. Yes, yes. The sauce, so delicious. Took down those spices. Right, right. Ginger, not overpowering I thought it was gonna be. So many deep flavors in here from that spice mix. This is next level. I am so blown away by this right now. If anyone hasn't had this, I don't know what to tell you. You gotta make your way over here, this is great. Let's go. This right here, I have a feeling is a flavor bomb about to happen. Yeah, this is the one you made it, so it's actually even better. Hey, <laughs> hey. you heard him say it, right? I like that. Mm. Okay, wow. So the one thing I constantly keep hearing amongst the chef community in our state. Right. Is about your flavors here of this food. The, the bacon's still crispy, the flavors are all still in here right now. Uh, the spices, are you kidding me? There's so much stuff going on with this right now. Just like the starter, I said. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the combination of the spices can be infinite. Everything here is just, I mean, I'm blown away by the flavors. I get why ever so many people talk about you guys. What's a dish maybe you've put together? Has your wife ever been like, what are you doing? We're not doing that. Always. <laughs> I will tell her that. Always. <laughs> Don't put that on the camera. <laughs> Chef, absolutely delicious. Appreciate your hospitality. Thanks for sharing. Thank you, man. So Thank good, you for man. coming. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank this you. stuff Thank is you. next level. I just love coming here. It's such a happy, happy place. And I've met so many wonderful people. So come on down. Hey, Amir, you see Michelle? I want to say bye to her. Oh, yeah, I'll tell her that you say bye. I'll tell her. Uh, oh, she's right back here? Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to say bye to her really quick. No, no, don't. Oh, thank you, Magical Genie, for that awesome recipe. <gasps> what are you doing here? Get out of here. Oh, I'm sorry. You're I just, just want to say bye. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, wow. 